Okay, let's see. Need to fix that really quick. Let me drag this little section up here. There we go. Okay. Make the chat a little bit smaller so it's not overlapping with the video, the game. The scroll's good. Background's good. The little guy's good down there. Need to fix that good. real quick. Mm. All right, let me just make a tweet really quick and then we'll we will start. Let's see now. Let's see copy link, tweet. Let's get started then. Let's see. Uh, we'll do medium. I think that's good. This is the DLC for Bioshock 2. It's pretty, pretty good in my opinion, I think, anyways. Oh, this music. I need someone in here so I can see when my uh, audio levels are good or what. I'm assuming they're good. I'll just raise them up a little bit actually. 50%. What? No, don't do this, OBS. God. <laughs> Adriano, what's up? Well, I might have screwed that little opening cinematic up. reload that <laughs> how's it going Adriano okay yeah I know it's a nice little cinematic opening thing right there medium now we can do that it's one of the reasons the volume up a little bit seem kind of low put my mouse over here Oh, you got an exam tomorrow. That sucks. All right, now we can start. Oh, stop, please, controller. 1968. There's Minerva's den. Subject Sigma is approaching Minerva's den. He must not reach the finger. Detonate the tunnel. Well, you know we are in a giant suit, right? That's designed for being in underwater situations. I don't understand that. Okay, that's fine though. Mostly because we're not dead. You know, there's just starfishes. Okay. 
So that's the tunnel that we were in, it looks like. Hmm. Hello, Mr. Sigma? Can you hear me? The name's Porter. Charles Milton Porter. Doc Tenenbaum tells me you're here to help us get the thinker out of Rapture. It's not going to be easy, but nothing worth doing ever is. You should be able to get inside through an airlock. Yep. Okay. So... Yeah, so these little slug things, they give you Atom for your powers later on. It's good to gather them up now. I think there's like three in the starting area down here. So that's our task, is to get the thinker out of Minerva's Den, which we'll learn a little bit more about in a little bit. Which is okay. Let's see. That's the way that way. Pretty sure there's another slug around here. Yep, there it is. Gotta do some parkour to get it, though. There we go. Alright, now we can go back around. I love jumping underwater with these guys. Alright. Let's see. Okay, there's the airlock here. Minerva's den has been cut off from the rest of Rapture for some time, but not cut off from splicing. Don't let your guard down. The den's gone dark, but if you can reset the local power relay, I'll be able to get the juice flowing from here. Oh, cool. Oh, one second. Let me go fix something really quick. Okay, there we go. Alright. Make sure all my doors were closed and stuff. Let's see, let's start looking for stuff it looks like. Some more uh, recordings here. It's Andrew Ryan. Mr. Porter, let me be the first to congratulate you on the founding of Rapture Central Computing. The great chain only grows stronger with each pair of hands laid upon it. I trust that you and I will choose to pull Rapture in the same direction. Okay. Let's see now. So we gotta find a way to get the power back on. Looks like water's leaking that way, so that's a bad idea to open that door. Cool. <laughs> Let's see, got some more drill fuel around here. That's what we need. It's our only weapon. What steps into Minerva's den? Porter's newest toy? He wants to think for himself. Uh, but you see, old friend, the machine has chosen me. Oh. Uh oh. Sounded like bad guys were afoot. The thinker. Property of Reed Wall. Yeah, there they are. Reed Wall. He and I founded Rapture Central Computing together, but the greedy bastard pushed me out years ago. The splicers, the security. 
He pulls the strings in Minerva's den now. Okay. Can't buy anything yet either. The power's still off. Let's grab some more money though. Money's always good. Money's like the way to get stuff if you can't scrounge up anything from the world. Let's see. Ooh, forty-eight dollars. Oh, well, there's not much to know. You're under the sea, and it's ideal like city that went wrong because of genetic splicing, where you get cool powers and stuff. It's kind of hard to explain. Maybe I'll play them on stream one day. <laughs> I just wanted to do this one because I've never done the DLC for this one. I played a little bit of it, but then I just gave up like a year ago, so I figured now's the time. So we got ourselves a laser uh, gun now, which I'm not going to waste any of the ammo on, because we need it. Look at you, Sigma. You think that Porter is your ally, but the Thinker knows better. The Thinker knows. Uh oh. Here they come. The power is rerouted. That should tip things in our favor. Head up to my office in the executive that wing. Too. I've got something you'll need. Hurry now. So since you don't know, the red is our health, green is our, uh, or green, blue is our uh, magic, if you want to call it that. It's the Eve that allows us to do our amazing powers. Right now all we have is telekinesis. So, okay, that's hacked, so that'll be um, for us now. If any enemies come by, they'll get uh, a bunch of security bots on them. Let's see. So there's a new power for us, so we can make them uh, get attacked by stuff. Trick the security system. Divert bots, turrets, and cameras to attack where you choose. Send friendly bots on errands. <laughs> oh, I love those little cartoons. Okay. Okay, there's another Vita chamber for us if we ever die. No. Okay, now you're mine. Sports boost. Okay, so this is a passive ability instead of like a uh, plasmid. Let's see, move slightly faster, that's always good. Okay, let's see. There's some money here for us actually. Good to have money in case we ever need to buy something. Good thing she had drill fuel in her purse. Mr. Ryan hired me to build a computer that could keep an entire city running on time. The Rapture Operational Data Interpreter Network. Folks call it the Thinker <laughs> for short. We've harnessed the power of Adam even in this, allowing the mainframe to process data at the speed of thought. In other words, okay. thanks for us. Yes. And with the completion of the independent reasoning processor, it may finally think for itself. If Turing could see me now. Turing was one of the uh, code breakers in Britain. If you didn't know who Turing was that he was referring to. Tanbaum can provide you with a bonus tonic if you complete the protector trials. Master Protector Trial? Okay. Well, for now, we'll just grab uh, something that we can use here. Doesn't look like there's nothing here, really. Hmm. Can't get the extra plasmid slot just yet. We don't have enough. We can get the gene tonic slot. Because we have that extra little bit. We'll just save it for now, actually. Whoa, whoa, chill. Phone. Giano, you're making my phone go off. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's get going. Those vacuum bots sucked up all sorts of things before they went on the fritz. Crack one open. 
and you might find something there was something nice. Use. Okay. You will be exploding over here. Who left it? Come here. You're mine now. Ha ha ha. Attacker. Do it. Thank you. I'll be over here if you need me, robot. Oh. Yep. We have some pretty dumb. College right now, plasmids, telekinesis is kind of useless. I prefer something like electricity or something, but. Okay, let's go up there and hack him. Okay. Bam! Alright, cool. This area is pretty much ours now. Thermal cells. Some food. Money, that's good. Oh, spear ammo. I don't have a spear gun yet, but. <laughs> You're upsetting me. Right here. Come here. Oh, you come here too. Come here. There we go. Hacking stuff is good for you. Oh, we also got alternate ammo for this now. This one does fire damage. This is just a regular old laser. Can't do nothing this way yet either. Okay. Ooh, here's a spear gun. And it's upgraded too, which is good. Take that. The thinker's perfect equation has predicted your every move, Sigma. It knew you would be here. It knows where you will be next. Hey, spear gun. It knows that you will fail. I don't want to drink no booze right now. It'll make my screen all fuzzy. Wall's become obsessed with perfecting his predictive equation. The thinker can do plenty, but tell the future? No. The splicing drove him mad. Wall can rot here in rapture for all I care. We'll make a copy of the thinker and return it to the <laughs> land of the living. Oh, here we go. Uh oh. I got bad guys. Oh boy. No, that's a bad turret. Get some loot. Thermal cells, I'll take that. Alright. Let's attack this guy. Take him, he's a laser bot. Make sure to search these guys for all their monies. First aid's always good too. Mm mm mm. Ooh, what's this? Take you, and we'll take you too. All right, let's get out of here. I think that's everything in this room. Uh oh. Oh, we got him. I didn't think we actually got that one. All right. Ooh, rocket spears. Nice. And another tonic. Take your time. Okay. Cool. More gene tonics are good. Okay. 
Man, this laser gun's actually really cool. I don't remember using it in my last time I actually played this game. Adam is a predatory substance. After exposure, a constant supply is required to maintain its effects. Otherwise, the user deteriorates into madness. My plasmid, which releases the little ones okay. from their servitude, is promising, but limited. It only works on the children with the slugs in their bellies. On an adult splicer or big daddy, you'll see rejection effect. Undesirable. But, if the deterioration of mind and body were reversible, if Adam's sickness could be cured, All right. then its predatory nature would be no more. Okay, so Tenenbaum is the one that um, made the powers available for everyone. Oh. I don't get the feeling none of these guys are dead. The thinker has shown me so much. My outlook was limited before. Ball games and stock prices, dollars and cents. Ah, no, the, the, the numbers spiral out. They touch everything. Hidden within them lies a predictive algorithm for you, for me. Oh. That hack tool should come in handy. Head back up to my office. Let's see. Alright. I can remote hack stuff. It's always good. Let's see, ooh, another plasma time. Hacker's delight. Hmm. Oh, cool. We get to heal a little bit when we hack. Nice. Uh oh. I gotta hack again. Alright. Okay. And we healed. Minerva's den is mine. You think you can hack your way to the thinker? <laughs> You're welcome to try. <laughs> Okay. That was easy. Rapture depends on the right. thinker every day. Dispatching trains, connecting your phone calls, and keeping the Oh cool. Got extra first aid. We'll get some drill fuel and another first aid kit. I don't want to waste our money yet. Use your hack tool to spring open the door. That crack in the window looks big enough to get a dart through. Okay. We should loot everything. Bam. Someone set off one of our hacked turret, uh, not turret, cameras. Let's see. Could use the rocket spears, but eh. Wall splicers haven't gotten into my office thanks to the thinker's security. I'm giving you top level access now. Alright? Okay. Beginning scan. Sigma, please come in. Let's see, just tweeting out again. Hang out, okay. Sorry I can't be there to meet you in person. You've seen the state of the den these days. It's the thinker that's important now, though. I need you to get to the computer core and print a hard copy of the thinker's machine code. 
Core accesses and operations. There's an ops access punch card hidden in the compartment under my desk there. Oh, hey, BND. So grab the card and head or BDN. Ops. I always say BND for some reason. How's it going? I haven't been playing very long. Only about uh, half an hour. Hey, Demonic. Welcome. That first year in London working for Turing, I didn't see Pearl much. Spent all day and night in a... Potter's time is done, friend. And now you collude with this traitor to steal the thinker oh, away from cat. me? Oh, cat. Babbage. <laughs> Sigma must be removed from the equation. All right. Thinker, deploy office defenses. Uh -oh. <laughs> good, good. Good. Fighting this giant guy. Wall. He was a brilliant engineer. We saw eye to eye once, long ago, but the splicing made him paranoid, delusional. He'd murder us both to keep the thinker here. Okay, now we're out. Oh boy. Those uh, brute guys scare me a little bit, not gonna lie. Good to know he can take multiple hits from a spear. Thank you. Alright. So where are we going now? Right. Oh. central computing in your Rapture operations. Okay. Yeah, I think we need sh um electricity before. Hell, the maglock door is still active. It's regulated by the resistors plugged into that relay. If you can find a way to yank them out. Magnets fail, doors open. There's a plasmid that could do the job. They called it gravity well. Hmm. Okay, so we need gravity well first. Oh. According to the thinker's records, the airtight archives warehouse supervisor had a shot of gravity well on hand. Heading into the archives warehouse. I honestly don't think it is though. We have a big daddy here though. We can try to kill him and get the uh The Lancer is the most technically advanced big daddy that Rapture ever produced. <laughs> now it stands between you and the little sisters. And if there's any uh, that medium you need to add him demonic to by, it's Minerva's den. Yeah, I think we're gonna fight him. He wasn't that technologically advanced if we were killing him like this. Okay. Oh, jeez. Yeah, he's getting, like, attacked big time by us. Take that corpse. Let's drill him. There. Subject Sigma rises above the pack, hmm? Oh. Oh, that's right. I forgot you can adopt them. A futile gesture before the all-knowing thinker. There we go. Oh, she's adorable. Oh. oh, that's right. We can do like tower defense. Right. If I want to. Yeah, because that's the only way we can get a lot of Adam. We gotta defend her for a while. Do what you will with the girls. Twist your body with Adam. The Tinker's perfect equation accounts for all possibilities. Uh -oh. Come on, little robot guy, you better help me out. <laughs> Annie from Leek. That's ah, I didn't even make that comparison. That's pretty true, actually. There's a big giant teddy bear that saves her all the time. No, no, don't shoot me. Get out of here. Yeah, no one messes with her daddy. Damn. There we go. Man, these thermal cells are awesome. <laughs> Let's 
get our laser cells going because she's on fire. There we go. Man, all these spider splicers, man. I hate spider splicers. Oh no, a brute! Yeah, him. Fight him. He's the one that we need to kill. Light him on fire. Oh. No, not my robot. Is she done? Oh, she's done. Good. Are we gonna be together yeah, sure. Again, Daddy? Oof, plus 40 Adam. That's good. That'll be enough to get some more stuff, actually. Oh. Thanks to do it. See, can we get our spears back from him? Yes. <laughs> we just pull him towards us? Cool. Man, we're rich. Wait. I don't see him. Okay. Oh no. Leave me alone. I have played this before, but it's been a while. <laughs> it's the first time we've died, actually. There's our little girl. Come here, baby girl. Aww. Yeah, I like this Bioshock more than Bioshock 1 and Infinite. I think they got the mix of um, combat right. Plus, you can carry more than two guns. <laughs> like in uh, Infinite, you can only carry two. And plasmas were kind of lame, in my opinion. Okay, rocket spears. Go! <laughs> Love the rocket spears, man. Okay, heal. Okay. Let's get some health kits. We're rich enough for it, I think. Drill fuel, and I want some laser cells. I don't want to waste all my money just yet. Okay. So... Now we need to get gravity well, but we also need to find ourselves a um, a gatherer's garden so we can get some um, some plasmids that we, you know, got from our uh, little sister here. We got some atoms to spend. Let's see. Hmm. Winter's blast might be good. Frozen freeze people. Kind of want the bees though. Ooh, we have four plasma spots already? Okay. Alright, well that's good. Now we have bees. Bees are good. They're like the crows in Infinite. Okay. We need to get into that place. I just wanted to buy a new plasma just so I have something offensive besides uh, telekinesis. Which is kind of lame in my opinion. <laughs> you can only gather your spear ammo back, I think. Like, that's a big thing for it. No, I don't want to put them. I don't want to put her away. Right, Airtight archives. The door to the archives is shorted out. I'd check the McClendon Robotics Workshop. Okay, we need electro bolt now. <laughs> no, no. I, in my opinion, it's like the best Bioshock. It, one, you have to switch your hands a lot. The combat's a lot better in this one. The story's good too. Your hack tools should get you into McClendon Robotics. I think this one's the best Bioshock. Infinite was good and everything, it's just kind of story didn't make sense. Well, it didn't live up to the E3 hype that it had as well, in my opinion. I really recommend this one. Ooh, Drill Dash. Ooh. I think Walking Inferno. Push B while holding R2 to do a drill dash. Oh. Awesome. That was pretty cool. Alright. Oh, look, there's our rivet gun. Yeah, boy. Attack this, by the way. There. 
there. Now no one will be able to heal there either. Rivet gun's basically your pistol. A giant pistol though. Trap rivets are where it's at though. Daddy's giving you stores and birds. Bees! <laughs> the story was good in my opinion, I thought. There wasn't as much free roam as you would want. Like you can't go back and revisit areas, but uh, it was kind of like on a tram system. Once you're done with an area, you move on to the next one, and you can't really go back. But the story I thought was really, really good. How's the audio levels, by the way, guys? Let me know if anything needs to be raised or lowered, or if I'm too loud, or the game's too quiet. There we go. Oh, we can't heal. We'll come back for those at some point. Gobies. Oh no! The top secret! The bees will save us. It's dancing, Daddy! Uh -oh. Dancing! Be silly. Ask the computer to uh -oh. Robots are coming. The automatic chef made your Okay, thanks, Ray Train. Tuna surprise. Appreciate it. I didn't have to lift a finger. Where are these robots at? Oh, there they are. So we need something better. We need, yeah, thermal cells will do it. Light them on fire. Okay, you're mine. Audio's good? Okay. Just making sure, just making sure. Go, my robots, go. We need to find these cameras. Let's see, we'll put this to use. Bam, there we go. Now that's ours. Let's see how there's another security bot or vacuum bot. One second, one second, I'll be right back. Overkill. Okay, there we go. Oh, oh. Um, the laser gun. This is Minerva's Den DLC, so it's gonna. It's a little bit different. Now, I don't think the laser gun is in the. Um, is in uh, the Bioshock 2 standard game. Only in Minerva's Den. Uh, yeah, I get what you mean. So you got it for like 60 bucks for both games or something like that, I'm assuming. I don't know what the conversion rate for Canadian money is. Demonic. <laughs> yeah, see, that's what I meant by windows are being um, put in. I didn't realize they were coming back right now. Okay. Can we... Okay. Okay. Mm. <laughs> oh. 
I think I just swatted my own security bot. God. One second. While I wait for the hammers to stop. You guys can hear the hammers, right? I'm assuming. I thought I was going to have the house to myself for a little bit, but I guess not. Let me know if that's too much and I'll end the stream off here. We got, we've been playing for about 40 minutes now. Let's see. If it's unbearable, I'll, I'll uh, stop. <laughs> oh, here we go. Uh, okay, Eve Link. Uh, we'll have to store this one. We need more Eve ton or um, Eve slots to put in there. Okay, all right. As long as you guys aren't gonna be bothered by it, I'll play for another about half an hour, or maybe another 15 minutes or so, because I gotta go somewhere in a little bit. I just wanted to stream because I've been threatening to stream for a while and it just hasn't happened. All right. Oh, he disappeared. He's a ghost. We need the laser, or not laser, electricity. We need electricity from somewhere. Don't think it's in here, this is where we've been. Yep. Robotics workshop. Okay, we need to go here. That was just a storeroom, I'm guessing. Oh, look at that texture pop. Well, we're gonna save her, yeah. We need her to gather one more time so we can get the maximum amount of atom from her. Ooh, mini turrets. Okay. We'll have our mini turret out for now. Oh. No, we won't use our mini turret. We'll save it for probably uh, another gather spot. And we have to defend the little sister. <clears throat> because those are really valuable. Let's see. How do you bandage someone in a giant suit? Just curious. How do you smoke inside of a giant suit, too? That don't make any sense. Okay. Ooh, there's another gather spot. Ooh! Spear gun. More spear gun ammo. At least this will come as a surprise to you. What will? Oh, can you not? Yeah, video game logic. Get off of my head! Oh, that electricity turret is doing magic right now. Okay, we'll get all the stuff from them and then we'll begin our, um, our uh, tower defense. Go, little one, go! Okay, we'll get this out too. Mini turret. Bam! There's our boy mini turret. He's gonna do work. Is that is that too loud, guys? <laughs> Just curious. If that's too loud. Cause now there's scraping going on. Wait, wait. We have an auto hack. I'm gonna waste one. No, I missed. Go! There, auto hack. Okay. Hurry up, little girl. Are you done? 
There. Now we can put her back in her hole. She can't gather anymore for us, so she's good to go home. Take some of this stuff. More health is always good. Oh! Oh, we're out of fuel. No. He's already on fire, so I don't think the thermal cells are going to do anything. Let's get the bees on him. Not the bees. There. Alright. Not the bees. Wow, we are rich right now. I want to save my money, though. Just because I don't want to... Uh, run out of money and not be able to buy anything later. Oh, we auto hack that crap. I didn't want to. I want to do the regular hack. All right. Thing like that, losing the only person you care about for somebody else's war, it makes you take stock. I started seeing eye to eye with Mr. Ryan around okay. that time. And so, I brought my know-how down to Rapture. I built the thinker for him. And now it's all I've got. Aww. I wonder sometimes, what if I'd come around to Ryan's way of thinking just a little sooner? <laughs> little sister robots. <laughs> wow. Okay. Let's see. So we don't know the backstory with uh, Mr. Porter there. That's our guide through Rapture for now. Um, he lost his wife in World War II, and then he went down to Rapture afterwards to get away from it all, basically. Hey, Lego Freak, what's up? How's it going? Man, we took care of those guys. Should probably make someone mod. <laughs> I'll do mods in a while. I gotta set up my mods again. I think only like Martin's like the only mod I have right now. Besides my friend Chris. Oh, okay, yeah, we could rescue her now too. We got a bunch of Adam. I think like 80 or so. Maybe 120. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, 80. But that gives us oh 140. We can go buy some plasmid slots and stuff too. I wanna see. Where is the electric? We need electric. Hmm. Let's see, where, what's our objective right now? Find the gravity well plasmid. Huh. Need to find this gravity well, but I don't know where exactly it is. Maybe workshops. Those look like little sister clothes. Those maybe they're the robot little sisters. <laughs> Caution, watch your step. Oh. oh. Why not? We'll use it. Using them all anyways, doesn't matter, I guess. Let's see, what is this? Handyman. When your security friend takes a bullet, put them back in tip top shape with a bit of Eve. Oh. Yeah, we'll start that. That's another good one. We can upgrade our uh, robot helpers now. Nope. Wrong one. Don't look at me. Switch back to, uh, yeah, lasers. There we go. Oh, oh, I need help. Go bees, go. That was 
Let's go find a health machine or something. We have enough money for that, I guess. Let's see, there should be a, a circus of value somewhere. Oh, we could just use this. Okay, that should be enough. I just needed a health pack. Now I can go back in there. Yeah, see, so this is the place we need to go then. I already got the big giant taxi arrow to show us where to go. Should probably buy some ammo, thinking about it. Now there's an ammo bandito right here. Ooh, trap rivets. Those are good. Trap rivets are really good for uh, big sister fights when they show up. Ooh, ion lasers. Cool. Look, it's a robot little sister. <laughs> Bam. Ooh, a mini turret. Nice. about these robot little sisters. Yeah, this is the DLC Lego. Robotic little sisters. Robotic little sisters. <laughs> sure, Mr. Ryan, we'll take that contract. Sure, yeah. We'll front all <laughs> the R&D costs. No problem. And, and when the big daddies ignore the little robot girls and all your fancy field, uh, field tests, ah, uh, hell, what are we going to do with all the full production run of these useless things? <laughs> Yeah, I don't think those little robot sisters uh, worked out in the end. Okay, right, here we go. Here's one. Okay. We'll buy those. We'll get some drill fuel. And then some laser cells would be good. Okay, we're all stocked up now. Get too close. Ugh. There we go. Now you are friend. Okay, she has it. The little girl over there has it. We need to move those to get over there. Okay. Let's see. Girl's his wife, by the way, if you didn't know. Kind of hole in my mind. But eventually I got around to reflecting on Alan and his intelligence test for machines. I remember grinning about the idea that I could beat it. Design a machine capable of replicating Turing himself. And what would that show the old man? But then suddenly I realized I wasn't really thinking about replicating Alan at all. I was thinking yeah. about Pearl. He's gonna bring his dead wife back to life with the robot. Uh oh. That's not good. There? Okay, now I got two. Give me this. Electro bolt. Alright. This is the best <laughs> plasmid in the game. Could just stun people and whack them with the the drill. It's really good. Uh oh, hi guy. Let's see. Do regular rivets. No. Oh. Now we're blind. Oh, we don't have fire yet. Let's get the bees on him. Go, 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 go. Go, turret. 
We'll do thermal cells. Oh, we can light this on fire. Jeez. Okay. Alright. We'll go back to these. There we go. Now we can take the little sister. Yeah, super hot, right? Big Daddy, I'm Big Daddy. Man, there's just a pile of dead people over here. Okay, we're, we're good on stuff, by the way. Could do some more of this. But, you know, we'll... We'll do this and then we'll end it, because I gotta get ready to go somewhere, actually. So I wanted to stream a little bit today because I've been saying I would do Minerva's Den for a while. <laughs> Angels, I do, I do. Okay. Where'd our little turret go? No. Can you not? No. No. Just lasering people. Go, bees, go. Not the bees, not the bees. I'm allergic. Telekinesis actually would have been handy there for that grenade. Oh, bees, you're the best. <laughs> oh, that's right, he's on fire already. Uh, no, I'm not gonna. As soon as we get this gather done, then we're gonna. We're gonna stop. Oh boy. Because I have to go somewhere, unfortunately. I would stay and drink some more, but. I have to go somewhere. Let's see. Let's pick her up. Aww, adorable. Man, we have a lot of atoms to spend, too. Yeah, so that's it for now. I'll probably stream again when I get home in a little bit. So if you want to just drop a follow Ray Train, that way you get notified when I go live again. Thanks for coming out, guys. It was fun for for this little bit. We're not that far into the DLC yet, from what I know, or what I played before. So, yeah, we'll see you guys later. Let me just save it real quick. New save. Alright, bye, guys.